Hi you guys, Lindsay here. Welcome back to my channel, Inside the Hem. So last week I showed you my latest refashion. I took this skirt that I got at Goodwill and turned it into this super cute dress. I used Butterick 6447, which is a shift dress. I'm always harping about the fit of shift dresses and criticizing them if they don't have vertical fisheye darts in the back. For me, my bust size can be as many as four sizes smaller than my hip. Hashtag pear shape. So if a pattern doesn't have shaping through the waist, mine just gets lost and the dress ends up looking like a potato sack. Not cute. So Butterick 6447 does not have darts in the back. I ended up adding them to make the refashion and get this fitted look through the back. But I wanted to show you just what kind of difference the darts make. So I made another version of this dress without the darts. From the front, you can see that there is no defined waist, making my midsection appear larger than it is. From the side, you can see some drag lines starting at my bust apex and scooping around to my lower back. And from the back, you can see the pooling at my lower back and drag lines throughout. For comparison, here's the version with the darts next to the version without. What do you guys think? Do the darts make a positive difference? Do you think the denim version fits better than the jacquard? Is it more flattering on me? For reference, I added four one inch darts to the refashion. And if I'm being honest, I probably went a little overboard and could have gotten away with just two one inch darts. That would have maintained a little more of the ease in the back. But I do think the super fitted back suits this version well. So I'll be back next week to show you how to add vertical darts to a pattern. I'll also add them to this jacquard dress and show you another before and after. That's going to do it for today though. Thanks for watching and I'll see you soon. Bye!